basically uh, i am from odisha and uh, i was there till my 10th grade then i shifted to hyderabad for a couple of years for my 11th and 12th and then uh, you know i found out about jain university about uh, how it's among the top uh, universities all around uh, india so that's how i chose mechanical background mechanical as my uh, bachelor's and uh, yeah i completed my four years of engineering here journey in jain uh, was a roller coaster ride to be honest you know there was a lot of ups and there was a you know there was a time where uh, i hit a rock bottom too but you know i had the support of my teachers and uh, my mentors and everybody you know so they supported me throughout and they, they kept me going no matter what they are always behind they were always behind my back when you talk about jain right so the first thing which uh, comes into my mind is uh, the studies then the cultural activities and the sports all three things are equally well balanced and you know it's really helpful for a student so when you talk about academics you know you have the curriculum which is completely adjusted to your schedule and you have uh, you know the professors who are uh, who has done the phd and mtech in various different fields and you get uh, a lot of uh, ideas from them and then uh, when i talk about culture and sports you know the college pretty well promotes each and every single thing no matter what they will support you no matter what they are behind you and they are the, the best part that i like about it is you know we have various n number of sem, uh, n, n number of seminars n number of workshops that are being held in the campus so make sure that you take part in it and uh, of course you know your mentors are always there behind you to support you and uh, they actually give you a good platform to you so that you can come up on the stage and you can uh, give your various ideas and uh, you can present your skills when we talk about uh, global leaders you know everything comes uh, within no matter what uh, if you are a sports captain head or a cultural uh, secretary you know you have to take uh, take uh, charge of the whole entire unit so that that's how uh, you know jain helps uh, students to come up and uh, show their leadership skills and uh, you know emerge them uh, before i mentioned that uh, you know they organize various uh, social fest various cultural fest various workshops and uh, there is a sport fest too so what happens uh, in that is you know the all the responsibilities are given to the students when we talk about uh, opportunities given by jain i am talking about uh, the social uh, activities or the sports activities or the workshops that uh, being held in and around the campus each and every single uh, the responsibility is uh, shared by each and every single student so one such case happened in uh, my third year where uh, we were supposed to um, was, we were supposed to organize an event and uh, it, it's a technical paper event where uh, i was in charge of leading the whole team and uh, you know uh, calling the vice president of the university or uh, calling the chairman or you know calling the guest lecturers over there you know it was all on my shoulders and i distributed each and every single thing to my teammates so that's how as a group we came up and uh, you know the event was a huge success i would definitely recommend jane as uh, you know in my previous interview also i was talking about uh, you know the three pillars uh, about the cultural the academics and the sports you know the jane appreciates each and every single thing and of course the teachers of you know uh, teachers and mentors are always behind your back and they support you no matter what